Hey guys, what's up? Hi. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed Athena's vlog in Hawaii. <laughs> Did you have fun making it? <laughs> yeah, I had a lot of fun. It was actually my first time doing the vlog by myself. I just took the camera with me and edited the video all on my own. It turned out good. Right? It was alright. <laughs> it, it turned out really good, right? I it was it a learning good. experience for me, for sure. But I'll I'll do better next time. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> she did good. I don't know what she's yeah. talking about. It was, it was good. fun. Uh, today's like a little bit of a different vlog. You know, we're not going anywhere. We're not going out. Um, mm -hmm. We're actually just gonna be here at home talking to you guys about something that happened in our life. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of you guys probably already know that we actually adopted a bunny about four or five years ago. Yeah, yeah. he's our little guy, and his name is Almond Theodore. Super cute little um, ball. A little lop ear bunny. Super. Super adorable, um, but he recently passed away about a few weeks ago, and we miss him so much. A lot, so so yeah. much. We literally we didn't know that this little bunny could actually bring so much life into our into our own lives. Yeah, he brought so much love into our relationship, and he he was so special to us, and he was Super our little special. buddy. Yeah, yeah, we um, just we just so loved much. coming home to him and his little nose on our toes and eating bananas with him and just the little things you know that um, you start to really miss when yeah. your your pet is your part of your family. So yeah. it's been a really hard loss for us, um, but he's always gonna, always, always gonna have a special place in our hearts because he's our little baby. Yeah, so we decided to um, commemorate his life mm -hmm. and decided to actually get tattoos of him. Yeah. Super, super, super <laughs> cute tattoos of him. Very cute. And um, we actually got it done and... By his really good friend. Yeah, by my really good friend. classmate. Super good tattoo artist. He specializes in uh, stick and poke tattoos. You'll see a little bit more about him in just a little bit. But yeah, we just really wanted a, a marking of Almond on us because yeah. he had a really great impact in our life. We were excited to show him off in this vlog and everything, yeah. but unfortunately he didn't get, get a chance to do that um, and be here with us, but he'll always be in our hearts. Have a special place. And on our bodies. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. Uh, here's a little... Oh. Oh, we just miss him every day and then we think about him all the time. So mm -hmm. we're, we're really lucky that we were able to get these tattoos that it's it's him. It's actually him. Mm -hmm. So you guys will be You'll able see. to see. Um, we we thought about it and we looked at different kind of bunny tattoos and they weren't just we weren't feeling them. Yeah, it had to be authentic. It had to be <laughs> yeah. almond because we got him when he was super small. Yeah, tiny night. little baby. He was only like a couple weeks old when we adopted him, and yeah, he just grew up to be <laughs> an amazing bunny. Awesome guy. But here's a little flashback to that day. Uh, yeah, we actually tattoo. didn't want to record too much or like this this part of the um, vlog because we wanted to tattoo to heal and show you guys the final outcome of how it turned out and when it was fully healed so here's a little flashback just got to our friend's place you nervous mm -hmm. <sighs> it's gonna be a great tat I promise <laughs> <laughs> It's actually not um, regular tatting. He actually does stick poking, so it's single needle. And his art's pretty good, so. This will be my first tattoo. Yeah. He has a half sleeve. Yeah, you've probably seen it half sleeve on my left arm, but. Yeah, well, first time stick poking, so. Let's we'll see how it goes. Yeah, we're here. Little known fact Addison, this is Addison, by the way. We'll leave his information below for his. Uh, Stick poke tattoo. He's actually one of my old classmates, and we graduated B three together. So. So I hope you guys enjoyed 
enjoyed that little flashback of us getting our tattoos. They turned out super amazing and this was actually my very first tattoo and I'm so so happy with it because um, I've never been really sure about anything but when he had this idea I was like yes we're I will do that and um, I love it so much and I look at it every single day. Yeah I was actually I was contemplating it like <laughs> probably even like day after like Almond passed away and I was mm -hmm. like I should just ask her but I was thinking she might say no. I, I, I was the type of person that was like, I will never ever get a tattoo, I will never be sure of anything to be able to put on my body, um, but I, I was really sure about this, yeah, turned and I out love it so much. Amazing. Here's some a couple photos we're going to pop on the screen like right now. They turned out really good, right? Yeah. Yeah, they look great. <laughs> oh, wait. I just realized we didn't even show them pictures of almond, just a tattoo. Oh, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoy this montage of our little Almond Theodore, and we'll see you next week. <laughs>